Casteism in Uttar Pradesh. 65-year-old Dalit man assaulted in forced drink urine. Hashtag Dalit Lives Matter. A 65-year-old Dalit man, identified as Amar, was assaulted, allegedly assaulted in forced drink urine in Uttar Pradesh. The accused, identified as uh, Sonu Yadav, um, had attacked the elderly man's son with an axe. And after this attack, the father and son lodged a complaint. Yadav was irked at the victim's actions and was attempting to force them uh, to withdraw the complaint and settle for a compromise. A local superintendent of police said that the accused are among the influential people of Rhoda Village. He said that the police arrested the prime accused and added that efforts are underway to arrest all others involved in the incident. Um, he added in the statement, the superintendent, um, we won't tolerate any sort of bullying. What the hell? Okay. Yeah, this so... is really bad. This got news coverage after a um, video of this happening went viral. Now, I watched the video. Um, I don't feel like showing it to our audience. It's terrible. Um, you're muted. Yeah, we can. We can show it. Um, but yeah, it's, it's, it's absolutely um, disgusting. Um, I... This type of degradation is reprehensible. Um, and this man is old. Like, these photos in this video is horrible. Um, it's, I wanted to highlight this because um, it's particularly important to highlight what's going on with the Dalit community in India right now. Um, and there, I mean, I get so many Dalit and casteism related um, stories sent to me. There's only so many that I can cover, right? But this captures how severe it can get. I mean, it gets even worse than this. Um, but this is only this is only the tip of the iceberg of the abuse of um, Dalits in India, particularly in Uttar Pradesh. Um, do you guys have commentary? Well, I wanted to say um, two things. First of all, 65 isn't that old. <laughs> and um, My apologies. not that that excuses, not that that excuses what they did. But um, what I think, the one thing that I do think, it's really terrible that we're hearing about this continuously. But one thing I think is different about this particular case is that the authorities are actually doing something and saying that they're not going to tolerate it, at least making statements. I mean, we're hearing other stories where they're engaging in the violence themselves or standing around and watching. So at least there's some, whether it's tepid or not, it is still seeing some, you know, saying, you know, that we're not, you know, they're, they're saying they're going to do something and they're coming out with statements saying, which you don't see as much now whether it's we actually see follow through and anybody actually is really you know arrested and then convicted of this will it remains to be seen but at least the story isn't they police weren't standing around watching while this happened <laughs> i mean how good, low is very good bar? point though yeah i know but again we get what we, mm -hmm. we take what we get um so there are conflicting stories about like certain details of this some this story that i read didn't specify what type of urine other stories specified that it was cow urine um or uh there's a word for that i can't remember um but apparently this is not being forced to drink cow urine is not uncommon um being used to be harass abuse um dalits and christians in particular um uh, it's because it's considered sacred and purifying in Hinduism. So, assuming that this is cow urine, you're, you're being forced to create this thing that pur purifies you because you're so dirty and untouchable and such an outcast. Um, they're known to force uh, women and Muslims to do it. Um, and um, it's really difficult because, wait, I had some more commentary on this. Um... I highlighted this one yeah. by Soraya. 
Prevention of Scheduled Caste and Scheduled Tribe Atrocities Act. So for those who don't know, um, Scheduled Caste and Scheduled Tribe is basically um, the term for um, uh, low caste, I, Dalit, um, other um, historically like, abused groups. Yeah. Um, uh, the Scheduled Caste, Scheduled Tribe Atrocity Act is the law to prevent atrocities on Dalits, but 0% implementation. The authorities themselves are casteist. They don't bother preventing crimes. Yeah. Um, and the fact that this is done in retaliation of this person reporting that they were attacked with an axe um, makes the situation so much worse. So, like, what the 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 barriers that Dalits face for receiving justice under the law is severe and substantial. Um, and it's important that we continue to highlight it because um, the it's not like no so few people at least in the west talk about this but this affects a population of over a billion people i mean not all, all of those one billion are dalits or lower castes but they're it's part of that culture right um yeah. this, affects, this, this affects an astronomical number of the world's population and we i don't feel like um in the the West, broadly speaking, whatever the, the West means, it's not talked about enough. Um, do you guys have any more commentary, or do we want to look at comments on the Facebook page? I no, there's not. Uh, I just want to highlight this one, and Leo. I just wanted to get a chance for that. Thank you, Leo, because Leo is saying, "Sorry, I can't become a member. The feature is unavailable in my region." Would send my respect through Patreon, though. Thank you so much, Leo. I just want to highlight, though, but do not think, do not, you don't. Don't become a patron unless you're financially secure, though, okay? We really appreciate that. Whether you become a YouTube member or you become a patron or there's also PayPal in the description, that or any of that is whatever works for you best. We're very grateful for it. But again, do not do any, use any of those options if you are not financially comfortable to do so, okay? So again, if you're, finan if you're struggling financially, do not support us financially. There are many way other ways for you to support us. You could like, you could subscribe, you could share the video, but if you can, we appreciate it. But thank you so much, Lior. But anyway, uh, Rivka seems to want to say something. Well. I was just going to say that um, what you do hear people say about the untouchables is what they know about it often I hear is that it was a bad thing, but then Gandhi came along and he said it was bad and then they passed a law saying you couldn't discriminate. That's basically what you hear people knowing and that's about it. Yeah. At which least, is, which is I mean, not at all the whole yeah. story in any way, shape or form. Right. I mean, to be fair, things have gotten better, but obviously not near enough better it seems obvious but i guess we have to say it um all right thank you for joining us subscribe to our channel hit the bell thingy if you haven't i don't know why what has what's holding you back okay if you haven't subscribed to our channel why haven't you subscribed to our channel explain that to us please like bell <laughs> and also if you if you're not getting notifications and stuff because youtube is not Telling people that we have shows because YouTube is like, oh, this person told us that they want to get your shows, right? They want to get your videos, but nah, you, we think it's no. And oh, look, oh, they also hit the bell button, but nah, you guys are too controversial. We want to show them mainstream stuff. We want to show them CNN or cat videos or whatever. But even there are people are like, no, we want to see Atheist Republic. And YouTube is like, no, we don't think you want this. They're like, no, please show it to us. We say to you, we want to see Atheist Republic. And YouTube is like, no, we think we know what's better for you than you yourself. So to solve that, link there's a link in the description, uh, which is to our newsletter. So hopefully some of our, we could email it to you. So hopefully you get some of our content that way. Okay. So yeah, subscribe to our newsletter as well. And share, share our videos because... You know, we do get demonetized, that's an obvious, on every one of our videos, so F that, 
but we don't care about that anymore. <laughs> but we also get deprioritized, and that's even more damaging to us. Deprioritized. What does that mean? That means we're not. We don't show up on the suggested, you know, videos on the right, and all that, you know, on the on people's homepages. And that's how channels grow. Unfortunately, we can't grow. So we need you guys to share our videos 